Thomas Crofton Croker was born January 15, 1798, in Cork, Ireland, as the son of Army Major Thomas Croker. He traveled Ireland from 1812 to 1816, collecting legends, folk songs, and keens. In his teen years, he helped establish the Cork Scientific Society, as well as co-founded the Camden Society in 1839, the Percy Society 1840 to 1852, and the Archaeological Association in 1843. He was a member of the Society of Antiquities in London, 1827, where he was a student of antiquities and things of the past. He edited and wrote for the Literary Political Examiner, 1818, The Morning Post and Keepsake in 1824, as well as Fraser's Magazine and Gentleman's Magazine. Croker's most recognized work Fairy Legends and Traditions of the South of Ireland consists of personal collections of folklore taken throughout his travels with notable partner Joseph Humphreys during the years 1825 through 1828. Another primary book of Croker's is titled Popular Songs of Ireland. Written in 1839, this antiquary is a record of rare ballads and lyrics sung by local Irish communities of the South. Also, his collaboration with Thomas More led to the researches in the South of Ireland, which was published in 1824. Other than Croker's writing, he was also known as a painter, in fact illustrating his own work as well as contributing to pages of Thomas More's book, Irish Melodies. Overall, Croker's artistic talents were well known and in fact admired by Scottish novelist and poet Sir Walter Scott. Scott described Croker as little as a dwarf, keen-eyed as a hawk, and of easy prepossessing manners. However, the most iconic literary connection to Croker would have to be the Brothers Grimm. Jacob and Wilhelm Grimm were born in 1785 and 1786 in Berlin, Germany. They are known today for their dark twist on classic tales and legends of the 1800s. Both brothers studied law at the University of Marburg from 1802 through 1806. After graduation, their focus was primarily on continuing their literary research. Apart from their most famous piece, Grimm's Fairy Tales, they translated Croker's Fairy Legends and Traditions of the South of Ireland into German in the year 1826. Grimm's Fairy Tales embraced realist themes on the contrary to the movements of Romanticism and Gothic theory. Croker was inspired by their modern revisions and it is said that they all reviewed and praised the works of each other. After 1818, Crofton Croker lived in England as a clerk in the British Navy until he retired in 1850. He died August 8, 1854, and was buried at Brompton Cemetery. Hi, I'm Emma. And I'm Jess, and we did our project on Thomas Crofton Croker. I did his biography as well as the societies he was involved in. And I did his literary impact as well as connection to other authors with a special emphasis on the Grimm Brothers. I also did visuals for the presentation. I took those visuals and paired them up with some audio to create the video that you saw today. So thanks, thanks for, for watching! watching.